Hello, hello, hello. This is a pick a deck reading. Okay, we're gonna see are they coming back? All right, so I'll try to pinpoint whether or not they're coming back and if I feel like they are. Um, when? So we'll see. Okay, so this is deck one, deck two, and deck three. So you guys go ahead and choose the deck that you want. Or you can pick all three. You can pick two or whatever you want to do. All right, guys. So I'm going to go ahead and move the other ones out of the way and get started here. That is deck three. And this is deck two. We're going to get started with deck one right here. The Vice Versa Tarot. All right. So let's see. Are they coming back? First, we'll see what they've been doing, and then we'll progress down to one card. We're going to start with three. Let's see. <clears throat> Are they coming back? Are they coming back? What have they been doing? What have they been doing? Hmm. There's something that they have definitely learned, for sure. Um, with the world, there is an ending, but with the ending, of course, comes a new beginning. So there's definitely something this individual has learned. This would be Scorpio, Taurus, Aquarius, um, Leo energy, okay? Let's see. And then we have the King of Swords here. But with the back turn, so it's facing away. Um, I think there's something that this person is becoming aware of here. They're currently facing away from the situation, but there's definitely something that they are learning. Okay, so this is strong Aquarius right now. All right, something just jumped out here, and then we have the Seven of Pentacles there, Taurus energy. I'm getting that this person is is looking back on past experiences, what they have actually invested in a situation to see if, you know, they should devote some more time here or should they move on? Should they invest more? Okay? Hmm. They're at a moment of contemplation, this individual. And then we have the Six of Cups. Definitely um, thinking about you guys. Thinking about the, the good times, the good memories. Feeling like you guys are, you represent home for them. They feel very familiar and very comfortable with you. Have very loving memories with you. This person also feels like this is your soulmate. They're thinking about approaching you guys here. And giving you not just some love. Not just some affection, but giving it all to you, okay? Devoting themselves to you guys here. Scorpio energy. So now we have Aquarius, uh, Taurus, and Scorpio. All thick signs here. All right, guys? Let's see what else we've got. Okay. Uh, all right. So here we have judgment. Judgment is definitely coming together as a family. Rising from the ashes new, exposed, ready to, to learn, ready to give more, have new experiences here. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Ready to start a new life here. You see she's carrying an egg right there. Scorpio energy there as well. Hmm. Are they coming back? Let's see. Looks like it. Because I definitely see this. Are they coming back? Then we have the Knight of Cups. I definitely feel like this person is coming back. But there's something that they have to work out here. Because this person has some, some issues dealing with emotions. I'm feeling like this person's not... Um, 
they're not emotionally expressive. I feel like they they hide their emotions a lot. They may have some anger issues here. They're not comfortable expressing emotion. And so I'm really thinking that I'm getting that this person right now is really trying to figure out, you know, their feelings. They're a little confused here because they have these feelings for you and they really want to bring this relationship back into fruition but I'm getting that they don't really know how to express that okay so there are no wands here but I definitely get that this person is coming back now is I feel like this is gonna be a while honestly this is going to be a while. This is going to be anywhere from like 11 months, I feel, to the next two years. Um, it's going to be a while because not only do they have... Um, it's hard for them to really express. If it's not like a negative emotion like anger or frustration or what have you, then they have a hard time really kind of getting into um, really expressing their love. Very stubborn energy. Again, these are fixed signs here. So there's a stubbornness involved in this situation, okay? So this could take anyway, anywhere from like seven months, I feel like, to two years for this person to really come to grips. I don't know if you guys can wait that long, but um, I definitely see them reminiscing, wanting to start anew with you guys, okay? Whether or not they take any action remains to be seen because, again, there are no wands here. There's no action being taken, okay, currently. So that is deck one. And then we'll move on to deck two here. Let's see what's going on with them. What's going on with them? Are they coming back? Are they coming back? Are they coming back? All right, let's see. We have the Six of Wands. Feeling victorious, going, moving forward successfully. Coming out of conflict here. Moving towards the Two of Cups. All right, that's good. Wanting a relationship, wanting to be involved. Yes, going towards the ultimate fulfillment. Um, this is what is currently going on for this individual Leo um, Cancer Pisces energy here. Okay. Wanting to explore love um, to see if they can have this ultimate fulfillment in this relationship, I feel. Four of Wands there. Willing to bear whatever they need to. Go through whatever hurdles they need to in order to, have, to make this happen. This connection, I feel. Aries there. Oh yeah. Willing to do whatever is necessary to make this love um, last. To, to hold it up. To support it. Okay? And the Page of Swords. Hmm. Somebody's planning here. Okay? Somebody's definitely planning um, how they can make this love connection happen here. Definitely planning. I'm feeling this will probably happen in the next... Anywhere from the next week to the next two months. This person's coming. And when they come... They will definitely tell you exactly how they feel about you and what they want from you. So we have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Cancer, Pisces. Um, I'm feeling uh, Gemini energy is here as well. Okay. 
very straight to the point. This person wants it all with you and they see no point in waiting. It's just a matter of how to go about attaining it is what I'm getting from this, okay? Beautiful. Okay, so on to deck three. On to deck three. How do they feel? Are they coming back? What are they doing? <clears throat> are they coming back? Two of swords, very indecisive, I feel. I I'm getting that this person, you know, they think they're under indecisive is what I'm getting here but I, I'm thinking that they very well know exactly what they want to do okay they they're just not acting on it they're not acting on it is what I'm getting here they know exactly what they want to do okay king of wands very stubborn though this person's very stubborn I feel but um, definitely wanting to move forward with you guys okay Definitely wanting to move forward with you. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy, um, Aquarius, Libra energy here. Definitely want to move forward with you. But very stubborn nonetheless. Okay, then we have Justice. Um, Libra strong here. Somebody's trying to decide, you know, whether or not to initiate something with you. They, they want to make things right. They want to do the right thing. And that's what they're focused on. They don't want to make a mistake. Okay. So whoever this is, is not wanting to make a mistake. And they go back and forth in their mind about it. Do I, do I approach them or, or not? Because if I approach them, you know, there's a possibility that we can move forward and we can be good. But at the same time, you know, this person can reject me and decide that they don't want to move on. I have to move on by myself. And then I'm going to feel rejected and, you know, it's going to bruise my ego and that sort of thing. Okay. So very indecisive, I'm feeling. Okay. Let's see if they're coming back. Hmm. Definitely there is a choice to be made here. And they have it. This person has it. And if you see how these cards are lying here. Okay. See the angel up there with her hands like, okay, so you say you want to make it right. So what are you going to do? You, you can't have one foot in and one foot out. You have to make a choice. Do you want this person? Speak now for help forever hold your peace you know that sort of thing it's like what do you want to do make up your mind stop being indecisive here so what I'm getting from this is this person I feel like in the next month and a half or so that yeah in the next month and a half I feel like they will definitely um, make a decision on whether or not to come back and I'm getting that they will I'm getting that they will and it's probably gonna be within the next month and a half that they they that they reach out is what I'm getting here okay okay so again it's Gemini Sagittarius Libra um, maybe Aries or Leo and Aquarius energy is present here all right guys